Hi guys, I'm Ibrahim Mohamed from E Mohamed Lofts. Um, I just recently participated in the Africa Pro One Love series. You know, for me, just to be to be to be included into the Africa Pro was just amazing. Uh, being able to compete against the best in the world, and for me, just to get the stepping stone to see exactly where. Uh, and what, I've, what my achievements was, I mean, it was just phenomenal. When I started F sending my pigeons to the Africa Pro Loft, um, I thought, you know, well, which pigeons do I send? And I said, let's send top of some of my top ace pigeons. And, you know, that was my first thing that I did. And I, and I went to my loft and I chose great pigeons, uh, pigeons that I knew that would do, be consistent. Uh, being able to race the first year as a, in a one loft uh, series, um, being there, participating and sending those pigeons made it phenomenal for me just to make sure that, you know what, I could achieve something in, in, in raising pigeons. Um, my fir the, first, the first race at uh, Africa Pro was just phenomenal. Um, I think I went fifth on the first race and I was the first South African to clock a pigeon on the first race, which was, for me, I was overwhelmed. Um, I think by the fourth race, um, the pigeon that went fifth, uh, she became the ace pigeon. And you know what, surprisingly, she kept her stance. She made sure that she was persistent and she persevered right to the end and she became the final ace pigeon winner. And for me, that was the greatest achievement that I've ever had. And you know, making sure that, you know, I can maintain that, 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 that that status of having an ace pigeon, you know what, obviously everything is hard work. So for me to breed for next year, 2023, um, I've learned quite a lot as well by making sure that I have the right genetics and, and which foundation I need to build on. With Karyal being the ace pigeon at the end, for me it was just, uh, I, I was overwhelmed by the fact that she you know, she, she took the Ace Pigeon, she won the Ace Pigeon Championship with 55 minutes ahead. And like Mr. Hendrik said at the Africa Pro, he said, you know, he's never seen a pigeon that could ride, race any velocity. And for me as well, a good pigeon is always a pigeon that are most consistent. A pigeon that wins one race for me is not a pigeon that is that, 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 that I look up to. A pigeon that I looked up to is more a pigeon that's consistent week in and week out. And I think that's important on the racing pigeons uh, by choosing the proper and the right family of pigeons that can produce winners for you. Um, so basically, Karyal's mother, she is bred from our, our what Figo lines, cross with the Janssen line as well. She was outstanding pigeons at a time when she raced in my loft as well. She, I think she was ace pigeon twice and then the, the last year she won the ace pigeon champion as the best old pigeon on the whole entire federation she was just a phenomenal pigeon this is Kariel's mother this is the sister of the mother the power that they have is phenomenal as well as from the figo line this was one of my Federation winners, she put the best time on the truck. Her mother bred me 40 winners. So she is the nestmate of Karyal. Nest, nestmate. Karyal was 1803-1804. Because she bred me one check and one blue bar. And she's exactly the same, 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 same as her sister. She, she raced in my, in my loft and I took her out of the race loft and I said no she's got more value because what I've, her sister produced and what her sister proven to me. I've paired her up now with the son. That is the only son left out of the Africa couple from George Oswald. That is pieces of eight. This cock here is pieces of eight. You know, from many winners that I've, that I've got already, I think I won overall for the years that I've been racing since 2013. I think more about, sure, if, I, if I'm correct, probably about 60 federations already. So, which is phenomenal. And I think I've always been union champion. 
So I think that's a great achievement and that's a stepping stone for me. That's why I took part in the Africa Pro. And I think just by proving my presence from on an international level was just amazing.